computer science videos here today to show you guys in this tutorial how to reset your PowerBook G4 to factory reset without further ado let us start the video so in this tutorial you need to have access to the PowerBook G4 we can now start the tutorial let's turn on the laptop This may take some time depending on the speed of the computer. This is a very old machine. There we see the Apple logo. Let's boot into the OS. Starting the Mac OS X. Okay, so now that we have booted into the machine without the password we did not require, let's now shut down the machine itself. Yes, we want to shut down. We want more than shut down. We want a factory reset to the original settings. So what we are trying to do is go to safe mode. In order to do that, we have to turn on the computer and then press command and S. Now, keep hold of these two buttons. And yes, if done correctly, we should now see all the code on screen. This will allow us to factory reset to the original settings. So it then would feel like this is a brand new laptop. When you turn on the laptop, you are then given an introduction to the system itself. So now what we need to do is type in mount space. hyphen u w space slash enter that takes us to the next line r m slash v a r slash d b slash dot Apple tab everything automatically types in itself Apple setup done next line shut down hyphen H now before we enter all the code that has been typed on screen will be available in the description below enter We are trying to factory reset. And so now this is a brand new laptop for myself. The brand new experience. We have just taken out the laptop from the packaging and then we would power on the laptop and then 
we are introduced to a brand new user face. We would then need to create an account for ourselves. One, two, three. Welcome. In just a few steps, you can register your Apple product, set up your computer and sign up for a .Mac membership, which includes a powerful collection of software services specifically designed for your Mac. To begin, select the country, which is United Kingdom. Continue. Are we trying to transfer any data? No, we are not. Do not transfer any data. Continue. British, yes, continue. Different network setup. My computer does not connect to the internet. Let's just click on this for the moment. Continue. Now we have to register some information. So that's the information which you will not see on screen. Where will you primarily use this computer? Home. What best describe what you do? I am in the IT industry. So continue. Let's just pick a password. Continue. Register later. Correct, London, the time zone, the time is correct and the date continue. Done. Enjoy your Apple computer.
And there we have it, Mac OS X 10.4 Tiger. Let's now shut down the computer. Yes, we want to shut down. And so that's it with this video. I'll see you guys on my next tutorial. Thanks for now.